Hey guys, it's Reese. Look at this new background I got. Isn't it nice? Don't you love it? I love it. Ah. So today, obviously, is going to be my dorm room tour. Thank you guys so much for giving me such good feedback and views on my move-in vlog to college. And I know you're all waiting for this dorm room tour ever since I posted that. But I finally finished it. It's finally how I like it. And I'm so excited to show you it. So today I'm just showing my portion of the room because I do share it with a roommate and I don't want to invade her privacy or anything. But if I do get permission from my roommate, I'll definitely show an entire dorm apartment tour because I do have more sections to the dorm that I'm living in and I would love to show you how their rooms look and how our living room and kitchen and the bathrooms look. So if you're down for that, definitely let me know in the comments below and give this video a thumbs up. I'm still trying to figure out the background and everything. I really like how this is set up. The lighting is a little weird because it is coming from this side, but I don't think it's too bad. I'll definitely try some different angles and stuff like that. But yeah, I just, woo, I'm so excited. All right, I know you guys are waiting for me just to get into the tour already. So let's get started. All right, so when you walk into my room, this is what you're going to see when you walk in. I wanted to go with bright and light colors that were pastel and just made everything look nice and happy. So starting with the back of the door here, I just have this little flag that says class of 2021 because that is my class. We have this full length mirror that actually came with the dorm and to this little side here, I have a cork board with just some flyers that I got handed out stuff and things that I want to sign up for or possibly looking into. And I guess we'll start with the closet here. So this is my half of the closet. We do have a pretty decent sized closet that we just split in half. So I have all of my clothes hanging up there. This is not all the clothes I own. I didn't bring any of my winter stuff yet. I do have a few hoodies, but yeah, this is what it looks like. And then there's two bins up there. I just have extra towels and I have some like undergarments and stuff. Moving down, you'll see my tripod, which I just set up there for the second. But then I have my hamper. And this hamper is really great because it has some hooks on the side that you can just bring the whole hamper with you to the laundry room. And I have a few pair of my most worn shoes down there. So that is what my closet looks like. Moving on to over here, I have this hanging yarn. I don't really know what this is. It's from Five Below and it's super cute and I just wanted to hang it up somewhere in my room. And down here at the edge of my bed is a little bit of a mess but I have some extra snacks in a bin right there that I just really couldn't fit in the kitchen. That bag down there is just some extra bags and trash that I need to throw out. And then that Target bag is just holding stuff that I need to send back home when my mom comes and visit. And then I just have my everyday backpack hanging on the post of my bed here. So moving on to my bed itself, it's a little hard to see because my camera is such a zoomed in view. But like I said, I wanted to go with light, pastel, bright colors. So I love how these pillows all complement each other. The good vibe one is from Target. The wander one is from Bed Bath & Beyond, I believe. The little pink one is from Marshalls. And the big yellow one is also from Target. And then my bedspread is just plain gray, got some ruffles in it, wanted to keep it nice and simple, that is from Target as well. And of course, this beautiful blanket which just ties in all the colors of the pillows is from Target. I love Target, you guys know this. And then the latest addition is my tapestry. I am in love with it. It is from Amazon. I'll link the exact one below because I know some of you are probably wondering it. I think it just fit my color scheme perfectly. It's the perfect length of my bed and it just tied everything together. I was waiting to film this room tour because it didn't ship yet but it finally came in. And then I just have some fairy lights wrapping around the top of the room. Going to underneath my bed, I have these two storage bins here that are just clear plastic drawers. These are super helpful in college, especially when you can shove it right under your bed. I just have some like underwear and socks and like sports bras. I have my sleeping clothes, shorts, long pants, jeans, stuff like that, leggings and sweatpants, and then extra pairs of shoes down here. I'm not gonna go into each one specifically because they're really stuffed full and that would just make a mess everywhere. But yeah, I think you get the idea. And then right next to this, our dorm actually comes with a little drawer itself. It's got two drawers here. Let me just go and open it up. So in this top drawer, I just have a bunch of like extra beauty supplies. I have my medicine, my brush, just like every like toiletry you can think of is in here. And it looks like a mess, but I promise it is organized. I know where everything is. So 
I don't really need to go that much into detail. You can just see like my brush, I have extra body wash, my coconut oil, my makeup wipes. These are just the things that I grab for on a daily basis, so I wanted to keep them really accessible right underneath my bed. So this bottom drawer is a little bare because I actually didn't even have that much stuff to put in it, but that open bag right there that looks like a hot mess is actually just all my spare makeup and stuff and like nail polish and things that I just wanted to keep all together. I have my hot tools and then I just have some like random stuff. That's a game over there. Like, yeah, it's just kind of empty and boring, but it was just housing a few of those extra things. Alright, so moving on to my desk. This is just a little overview of it. I have this hanging picture thingy. This is from Bed Bath & Beyond with all my beautiful friends and family on there and my desk down there. It comes with a little storage bin to the side here and just some nice big windows but let me get you a little closer so we can see what's on my desk. Alright so right here to the side I have my water bottle which I just drink out of every day. This honestly appeared in one of my bags out of nowhere. I did not buy this. I did not like end up getting this on my own. It just appeared in one of my bags. I think one of like the moving people put it in there but I love it. I use it every day so that was cool. I have this little elephant that I brought from my old room. I don't really know where to put it so it's just kind of chilling there right now. And then I have all of my everyday makeup, and I can't tell if it looks like a lot or a little, honestly. Like, what do you guys think? Does that look like a lot? I think it's like a decent amount. And then all the stuff that didn't fit in the drawer is just chilling right there. I have my makeup mirror, and then it's just sitting on top of my little jewelry box with like my most worn jewelry. And then I have this little stationary cup here with my pens, scissors, got some like cotton swabs and stuff there that are easy to reach when I'm doing my makeup, and then some like sticky notes and like basic supplies. Then over here is like a cute little corner that I love. Behind the Universal Studios um, clapboard is actually my extension cord where I plug in all like my devices and stuff so it's nicely hiding that. I have some fake flowers, my favorite selfie of me and all my friends, and then that little plate is just like holding spare change in my headphones, it's kind of just random stuff. Yes, I still need to put a picture in that little picture frame there. Yes, it was $4 on sale. And then I have my Himalayan salt rock lamp. There I have my vlog camera and my phone just chilling there for easy access. And then my laptop. And finally wrapping around here, I just have this cute like slab rock bookend. Wait, pause. Do you hear? the sirens. <laughs> there are sirens every day where I live. I fall asleep to the sirens of either ambulances or cop cars. But yeah, there's just some more pictures of my friends. And then moving down here, there's this random R that I had nowhere to put. So yeah. And finally, moving into these drawers here, I just have like literally random stuff. I have like command hooks that are left over, notebooks, pins, like this is just a random drawer that we don't really need to go into too much. And then this bottom drawer, ooh, if I can open it, my god. And then this bottom drawer just has like um, some folders and binders and like other random school stationary stuff here. Not too exciting. And one final overview of my room. I do have this huge floor to ceiling window, which I absolutely love. I love waking up to the sun every morning and I love going to sleep to the lights of the city. And I do have this chair here. My roommate actually brought this. It's just a big pink fluffy chair and then a little ottoman. But yeah, this is my dorm room. So I forgot to make an official outro to this video, but I just popped out my vlog camera real quick to say thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. If you want me to do more college vlogs like Day in the Life or Get Ready With Me, definitely let me know. I'm totally down for it. If you want more like specific like makeup videos or like anything you want requested, let me know as well. I'm totally down for it. I have such like an open schedule I can really like plan videos around so yeah definitely let me know and I hope you guys have a, a wonderful day this feels good right here.